Jesus Christ our Lord strengthen and preserve you in true faith unto life everlasting. Your sins are forgiven. Peace of God be with you. Amen. Our service concludes uh, on page 187 in the hymnal or here on the screen with the responsive verses, closing prayer, and blessing. Please stand. Page 187. Give thanks to the Lord, for He is good. His mercy endures forever. Whenever we eat this bread and drink this cup, we proclaim the Lord's death until He comes. We pray. We give you thanks, O Lord, for the foretaste of the heavenly banquet you have given us in this sacrament. Through this gift you have fed our faith, nourished our hope, and strengthened our love. By your Spirit, help us to live as your holy people until that day when you will receive us as your guests at the wedding supper of the Lamb, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine on you and be gracious to you. The Lord look on you with favor and give you peace. Amen. Amen. You may be seated for our closing hymn which again is printed back in the bulletin or here on the screen. Uh, the Spirit of our God descends sung to a uh, tune of familiar hymn. So we sing. <laughs>
Thank you all for coming. Uh, special thanks to those who are visiting us today or who joined us on our recorded service. It's a special day of the church year, Pentecost. Send the fire and keep sending that fire. Uh, calendar for the week you'll find in the bulletin. Uh, uh, now that we're in summer break, so there's a fewer things that are going on. Uh, next Sunday we will have an evangelism meeting following the uh, St. John's service. And then in two weeks, uh, we'll have a farewell for our teacher, Caitlin Tindall, who's leaving us and getting married. So it's a good thing for her. Uh, so that'll be uh, uh, on June 11th, after the 10 o'clock service at St. John's with the lunch downstairs. Uh, no hands in prayer uh, in, in, on June, June 5th. Uh, we'll wait till the Tuesday after Labor Day for the hands in prayer. You're welcome to stay after uh, here at Emmanuel for snacks and drinks in the parish hall. And uh, yeah, don't forget to pick up uh, copies of the assignment list from Martin Luther College and uh, uh, our seminary for vicars and pastors. We're excited. Yeah, so one daughter lives 14 hours uh, southeast and one daughter will live uh, 14 hours south uh, yeah. uh, north northeast. So we'll be going east one way or the other to travel. No, we're excited. Um, the Forwarding Christ magazine for June, that's also there in the Hindle rack, the meditations that begin today, uh, and uh, gift Bibles. Thanks, Emmanuel, for two cases, one for here and one for St. John's. I'm giving them away like pancakes, so we may have to order some more. Um, of course, tomorrow is Memorial Day, and uh, we do have our um, uh, uh, gift box for the, to support those, uh, those serving in the military. Again, uh, we uh, thank God for those who gave their lives to fight for our freedom, or those who return home after serving and then who have passed on since then, and their families, or those who are continuing to serve. So we thank you for your service. Uh, neat little uh, brochure that are out there to talk about what that means uh, for Memorial Day, from a Christian point of view. All right, uh, those are the announcements. Anything else, uh, Daryl or uh, Tom? Yeah, Daryl's the old president, Tom's the new guy. All right, well, thank you all. God bless your families this week and this weekend, Memorial Day weekend.